Hello there good fans! Today in Light Match Gaming I will be checking out Death and Taxis. Ooh, goody. Right. Nope, I don't want to skip intro. Okay. Okay, so we have fate here. Keeper of the World Order. Good to know. He needs lemons! Where will they get lemons? He goes to the store, like, uh, which is across the way from Abbey Road. Buy some lemons! Uh oh. <gasps> See some fires, pray perturbed. He goes back to 1801. He performs the spell. <gasps> and he creates me! Hiya! Uh, okay, so. Ooh, customization. I like. What should we go for? I uh, like this spectral form. Ooh, it's nazi. Harley Quinn or Two Face? Man in black? Tiger King? I think we'll go for Snazzy. Nice, I like it. Let us continue. Finally, the new spawn has awoken. Hiya! I am new spawn. What a, a momentous day. I am honored to welcome you into our world. Spawn. Hang on. Spawn number four, nine. Come on, you're not going to give me a name. Can you tell me you've already done this 48 times. I am the keeper of world order. What I want to ask is, what's the lemons? Ah, I don't care much for it being just 49. Can I be fate? Another ironic one. Great. No, you may call yourself the Grim Reaper. As that is what you are. I'm not very grim. Have seen my outfit. Welcome to your new job as an overseer of Cosmopolis City Subdivision Four. Yeah, I'll check out Robert Person in a limo. Wine region. Hmm. So, a lot of alcoholics. I know what you are thinking. Can finish yes. them off. Your assignment is choosing humans who have to die. Pretty standard stuff. Why am I choosing? Surely they know how to die by themselves. As it I just need to escort them. Day, try to get to know the system. And do not destroy the world, yes? <laughs> Gallows humour, you see? Oh dear. Right. Like yes. kitty. <clears throat> Clear? <sighs> Will I get paid for this? Most certainly. The contract stipulates that every death gets a fair salary based on their performance accuracy. Good. Marking profiles correctly is the most important task. If you mark more or less than necessary, you will not get your fee. But if you know more. who's if you know who should be dying, can you not just mark them? Errors in secondary tasks or just tell me who? reduce the total even if the primary task is <laughs> executed correctly. Oh dear. Right, okay. Remember, the fate of the world lies in your hands. That's such a Humans big mistake. Humans march towards the great dying. Mm -hmm. They always teeter on the precipice, creating endless chaos. I take it they can choose the one color. We keep humans from falling off. We establish the equilibrium and keep the chaos in check. For that reason, your actions will have consequences. Oh goody. Another game that says it's going to tailor my experience to my decisions and then just pick one of three paths. Um... All right. I will show you your work Take me to my work. right away. Follow me. One more thing. This will be your seven-day evaluation period. Oh no. 
When the week is done, you will be assessed. Assessed to say. One week to show us what you are made of, Reaper. And then you're going to send me back to the abyss. I'm guessing, because I'm not going to do very good, because I don't want to kill anyone. Ooh. Hello, Grim. Right. Instructions for the day. Let's see. Let's have a look at this. Welcome, Grim. You are the files on humans who are in life threatening situations within your domain. I'm granting you time to settle in, so no difficult rules and requests as of today. Water for the day? One human has to die. Send me the files by fax after you've made your decision. Good luck on your first day. Fit. Okay, so yeah, this game is kind of like uh, Papers, Please, which I really enjoyed. Uh, tip rules. Check out these awesome personal deck packs. Okay. Can I? Nope, I can't actually check them out. Okay, what's in this drawer? <gasps> wow. Cover this new? Yep. Nice. Good for organizing stuff. Nothing in there either. I mean, no, can I move the foot? Yep. I'll put the phone in there too, because I really don't care. Okay, so who have we got here? <coughs> ah, nice. So we got Ewald Buddy, 32, neurosurgeon. Ewald, a child prodigy, has been performing brain surgery since the age of 18. They're well established. Hang on. Seriously, since he was 18, I'd, I'd ready to get his license. They're well established as a medical professional in academia and in practice. Ewald is addicted to adrenaline and is well known for taking great personal risks. Oh dear, oh dear. Gillian Van Dulken, on the other hand, a thrifty zookeeper. Some say their mother was reborn. Some say they're a fairy tale princess. But whatever the truth, Julian is a zookeeper who gets along fabulously with animals. Birds sing when they're near and talk around town. Says no plant has ever died in Julian's house. Wow. Um, do not ask me again. Here we go. And you can live. Thanks that way. And. Doopy doopy doo. Ooh. No, I wanna go. Ah, okay. Who is. Whee! No. No. How do I get out of the damn lift? Treasure. What ho, customer! Welcome to Quarter Matter Mortimer's Blender Emporium. Hi there. Yes, I am Mortimer, the Mortimer, the one you may have heard of. Ah. The famous, nay, Death's assistant, infamous Quartermaster. Mm. Mm. What makes you infamous? Why, I was the very pirate king of lore. Sorry, infamous. Feared across the world. Even as I have grown most humble with age, mm -hmm. I still carry within me glory days. I, ye are visiting me ultimate dream, the Emporium! Emporium! Your will. They'll do. Ah, a visage which is an equal parts bold, gruff, Smooth and cool, straight from the old days when expensive advertising told me smoking was cool. Unholy smokes? 200. I've got nothing at the moment. Uh, got the animals of transients, which help keep track of any passing temporality. So it counts days in a month from 1 to 28. Those are all the days. All of them. No more. No 29. 30. 
Don't know what it means. A looking glass gazing ultimately deep into the abyssal depths of the underworld that reflects everything. Well, mostly just you. Why would I need that? Calendar may be useful. Hmm. That's his return. Since I have no pay. Let's check her feet. Hi. The new death spawn. Welcome. How was your first day? Really good. Great. We are counting on your dedication. You do important work, after all. Okay. Remember, lives are on the line. I'll bear it in mind. I see exactly one person perished today. Mm -hmm. As tasked. Did you figure out the best choice? Nobody True, deserves to in die. General sense, people are complex individuals with hopes dreams and dynamic thought patterns trying their best yet all end eventually eventually such is the unfortunate indisputable incontrovertible ironclad law of cosmos if you say Question. so yep. keep okay. your eye on the letter for future guidelines and keep up the good work you gonna pay me yet? A new day awaits. Off you go now. I got the feeling the cat's talking to me and it's not this guy. The cat's actually fee, isn't it? Okay, let's go. <gasps> the honored to the store for useless shit. Oh, wait a minute, it was my 200. Eh, nah, I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save up for that calendar. Ooh, end of day? I guess so. Didn't realize I slept. Cool. Spawn mail. <laughs> money. Is my money willing? Let's see. Cruel news: Cosmopolis dies in fatal crash after a tragic jetpack malfunction. Research for experimental surgical cure for epilepsy halted due to grant withdrawal. Is that my fault? A team of ragtag oil drillers sent to outer space to counter imminent asteroid impact threats. Oh, come on, let me kill them. I don't want to miss a thing. I don't want to miss a thing. That was a fun movie. Encourage Michael Bay to do more. Morning, Grim. I hope you found your accommodations adequate. Here are the rules of the day. Follow them, and it will be okay. I'm handing you another simple task. <laughs> Let's see how simple you think it is. <laughs> Quote for the day, one human with an engineering or industrial background has to die. But this is usual fate. Okay, thanks for that. Oh. We got the one, we got the two, we got the three. Right. Bruno Billis is an infamously gruff drilling expert who has been working in deep sea oil workers for countless years. They have a tense relationship with their offspring, yet have lately been attempting to reconnect to make things work. Throw you off. Oh, you need to die. Let's kill you. Um, Lakshmi said. Lakshmi. Uh, used to work in the animation industry, but grew increasingly tired of stress due to lengthy work hours. These days, they're self employed. Running their own tiny art studio and taking commissions from a business to just general fan art enthusiasts. 
Ja, nee. Serena, Mess Vida, seven four electrician, a mid electrician enthusiast. Uh, yeah, you're not, you're gonna live, frankly. Boom. Okay, actually. Can we just check? Engineering or industrial? So, yeah, you. Um, Serena has continued working as an electrician well into their retirement. Although their grandkids keep telling them to retire, especially due to bad eyesight, their love for the job will always win. Aww. My job here is done. So what do you think? Did I make the right choice? Was I wrong? Hello. Grim, how was the second day on the job? It Great. gladdens me to hear that. I get to take part in our again. So, did you follow the rules properly? Of course I did. Great. Yes, everything looks to be in order. Oui. Continue the good work and do not let tough choices get you down. So it's great. Great indeed. We could use more spawns with your attitude. Rest well. You will need it. Hello. Hello. See you soon. Oh, kitty. I can afford a calendar. Jolly Roger. Oh, Again, ye honor me peck. kindly so with your visit. I'm going to stay informed. I'm sorry, I'm going to be dull. Shiver me timbers. Tis a tale most sordid. Ah, sure, sure. Yeah. Okay. Oh. She got the freaking gerbil. Ooh. Ooh, that'd be a present. Cool. I'll check that out in the morning. He opened me. For that for now. Morning, Grim! A new bed on! You ought to know the drill by now, but just in case, here's another simple one. No special request today. Try to follow the rules, choose the most, choose the appropriate profile, then send them to me by fax. Today, two humans have to die. Give up the work. Fate! Right. What's happening in the news today? It's a uh, fire caused by loose wires investigation finds. Oops. Uh, a team of astronauts sent to destiny asteroid that threat valiantly give lives to complete mission. And when I missed the Astrophysics. Astral Physicist Union says tribute to fallen working class heroes. Pay tribute. Okay. Uh, consultancy is a new form of dark magic. Yep. Yeah, definitely is. Right, okay, so I may have caused the fire. Sorry. Two of these people have to die. Right. Any two. Just pick the ones that look like they're about to. Columbus is a distinguished war veteran. And these days working as a well regarded passenger airplane pilot. They're happily married and have five children. As a hobby, Columba is extremely interested in the history of religious buildings. He should be fine. Sky Nathan, data analyst. Despite a liberal arts education, Sky works in the space industry, writing programs to analyze satellite data. They live with their spouse and cats. Any spare time they have, they enjoy sitting in the hot tub. I mean, who doesn't? Okay. Fairly dull life. Essie is a professional project advisor, also known as a consultant. Okay. 
They get paid inordinate amounts of money for consultations, which are these vague events where they tell companies to do things. When not working, they love tea, cross stitching, and smashing the patriarchy. Oh well, in that case, smashing the patriarchy. Lil has been in politics for 40 years, and in that time, they've worked hard on relaxing the government's meddling in the real estate market. Although nobody has found proper proof, there have been rumours that Leo has taken many bribes from a number of realty agencies. Nice and easy. For 40 years, Terry wrote charming, fantastical novels for young adults alike, up until their health began to deteriorate. They still try to write every day, but the process keeps getting more and more difficult. They've also made substantial donations to many health research trusts. Well, hmm. I'm so sorry, but that's a bit sad. That's a bit of a bugalus. I hate you, game. Spawn. Three days you have been with us. How do you feel? I feel like hungry all the time. Probably How is that possible? The psychic residue left over from the creation. Making a death is not simplistic alchemy. Okay. Now, let me take a look at the files you sent in today. You hurt me. Right. Everything looks to be in order. You have followed the rules and marked the correct amount of profiles. There really is not much else to say. You may leave. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow. 